Hello my friends and welcome to episode 12 and here we see the German paratrooper teams bravely fighting behind the enemy front line. The line is definitely still there. <laughs> it's uh it's very important that we um we really, you know, celebrate the heroic deeds of these paratroopers. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. attack with some units that actually need some EXP. I'm not going to repair this. Uh, or am I? I was going to say, like, I don't have the greatest amount of these. I just shuffle the auto repair hero on it next next mission. Thirty three left. What on earth is this monster? Right. Looks like as close as I can get. You know, once again, there's an opportunity here to get tank kills. There is, a, there is a genuine opportunity here to just get hordes of tank kills. Without paying for them, as it were. units are mine so it doesn't really matter. There's like 14 turns left. I have no idea how much stuff is still on this map. I can send a scout car up there to just tag these. Not that prestige is something I really think about anymore, but you know. They 
wouldn't dare because of the anti-tanks. I already know that there's nothing up here. But I'll just scout out the position anyway. Right. He can't reach anything. He can get to there. I don't think any of these units have got... No. Save this one. Take that. You know that that is an opportunity to put thirty tank kills onto this unit. That is a lot of tank kills. This one actually still needs experience points as well. Yeah, the trucks are not really worth experience because they're not real. They're not real! So gotta be a little bit careful. They took my supply hacks. Oh well. Okay, there was nothing up there. I forgot about this artillery. That was dumb of me. Okay, there's nothing here but trucks. This 
This only needs uh, this only needs ten more vehicle kills, and it will actually be maxed out. Uh, this one's already maxed out. None of these units actually count. Let's just get rid of them. Alright, there's some tanks. Boom! Plus three to hard attack. Glorious. I only have to destroy one more British structure. And then I guess I get these two American ones as well. This is like a training mission, man. This is farm farm town. This one to hard. Can't quite reach. Oh, some tanks down there. Gained a star. This is the one that desperately needs experience of all varieties. Eh, this, I mean, this doesn't need tank kills anymore. We're done. Anything else would be a waste. There's plenty of time. There's no uh there's no pressure for me to destroy all this delicious EXP. These, you know, these little bonuses are actually worth a hell of a lot. Remember I said that one of the most powerful heroes in the game, which sadly I don't have, is the um, Butcher and Tank Killer, which add plus five to uh, versus soft and versus hard, respectively. Uh... 
Um, those are very potent. Um, Potent heroes. Nice. Uh, it's just because of the way that the interactions work with uh, defense. You know, a ground defense of 20. Just as an example, and a hard attack of 16 means I've got a minus 40% chance to kill. But if I had plus 3, I'd only have a minus 10% chance. So it's it's pretty big. Okay. I'm going to just presume that everything needs tank kills except that one artillery. Having murdered its way through everything. Right. Just go ahead and delete that now. Nice. another anti-tank depot. To be honest, nothing here is actually worth anything. Except experience points for uh, this. And this. KV, so slow. got a flank on me out of nowhere, but he still didn't attack. Um, I don't think any of these guys actually need experience, no. Oh, the anti-aircraft gun needs experience, but it's not going to get it, obviously. Twenty-nine, wow. Right. Might as well. <clears throat> uh, 
<clears throat> Goodbye, Allied Depot. Wow, this is just like a stroll through the countryside. Oh, a tank. And a Humber. Oh, the tank is good for tank kills and the Humber is good for experience. Give me them tank kills. This unit also needs experience, but it's too bloody slow to get anywhere. Uh... Oh, there's an enemy tank there. about reach it. Right, I'm just going to eliminate it. Just to prevent it from doing anything dangerous. I know that there's a little, a small group of tanks there, but they're not very strong. Can probably be safely ignored. tanks. A smorgasbord of experience points! Let's just park here for now. Fine, this is protected by these two and they're quite meaty. Oh, aircraft, of course! I could train up my AA gun on those. Why didn't I think of that earlier? Catch. Of course, the American aircraft are the perfect thing to shoot at. for the next however many turns. They provide me with some entertainment. Let's go for the anti-tank gun. Oh, these guns are worthless. Yeah, they're not valuable. EXP is calculated on value. Oh well.
I'm actually risking my scout cars here, but I have so many that uh, it's really not a problem. Bomf. Nice. Um... Let's just go ahead and get rid of those. Three tank kills for this guy. And a few more here. It's probably like a hundred EXP there. Oh, infantry. These guys, especially, would appreciate some more. Hit points worth of infantry. You can't win, I have the high ground. That is a lot of aircraft. If only I had brought some more AA guns to this party. Five hundred. Oh, of course, there's no ammo. <laughs> I'm like, why is the recon car not fighting back? Uh, why is the uh, waffle not fighting back? It's got no ammo. Okay, these are all worth about the same. 200 EXP per hit. I've only got four turns left though. Nice. Uh, I don't know if this is really, really matters at all, but. Fun. Cool. 
There's some more infantry over here. <laughs> this is uh, uh, this is not how this mission is supposed to be played, but you know. Nothing like a little artillery only action. Only needs 41 more kills. Kill him. Oh, there's a couple up there. I must feed. Ooh, only eight. Only eight infantry away from maxing out. Also working on his infantry badge. he didn't see it. So yeah, this is a uh, 1510 and then I hit a plane. 155. Nah, it's not that great. not that great, it's only like 50 points per turn. Right, I better start cleaning this mess up. Goodbye, American stuff. What happens if you just play the mission to the last turn? Infantry! My good friends, experience points! Feast! Feast upon the delicious infantry! Wasn't that what you needed? Oh, no, needs five more.
feast upon the infantry. There looks like a fun time. Oh man, there's some tanks up here. There are some tanks I could be feasting upon up there. That's a lot of planes you just lost. I just, out of curiosity, I want to know what happens if you don't signal to evacuate. If it ends in defeat, I'll just uh, reload the start of turn save. This one is completely maxed out. Oh man, it does come out as defeat, that's hilarious. You can't actually load from that screen either. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> Any more defeats like this and our enemies will be undone. <laughs> That's so funny. How can that result in defeat? 
I guess because uh, it wants the triggers to be assessed or something. Several reports and message and a messages for your attention, my general. What? He is impressed with our efforts and will keep us in mind for future special operations. Have to admit, I'm not exactly sure I like the sound of that, so I give him a reminder that we are first and foremost a Wehrmacht unit. Our outfit. Alright, an urgent message from Galand. He explained to me there would be major air operations being conducted in France, and none of it sounds good. He has prepared a gift for us and offer our ground crews and pilots to spend their vacation in northern France instead of Germany. Promises to put on a special air show of new jet fighters in our honour. If we take his offer, we should expect to commit our air forces to repel potential cross-channel invasion. Alright. Divert aircraft to assist! I'm going to presume that I'm not even going to be allowed to deploy artillery on this mission and therefore I will be forced to use aircraft. But let's see. <laughs> I could build an artillery piece with plus four range. Eight total. And maybe I could sink ships with it. <laughs> so, uh, we'll see. If I'm not allowed to deploy ground units, I'll have no choice but to field an air force, which will make a welcome break from blowing everything to pieces with artillery. Okay, mine general, General Lieutenant Gallant has arrived for our briefing. Good day. Okay. We certainly challenged the English Channel that day. High Command's Director to end all surface raiding. The American and British invasion we have been expecting. Impossible to know, especially with no one answering from the wolf's lair. Look on the bright side, we can enjoy some freedom of action and blame it on communication disruptions, and for once it's not a lie. Okay. Primary objective, none. Assist Army Group B in capturing all victory hexes. Eliminate at least 22 Allied paratrooper reinforcements. Sink at least four Allied battleships. Okay.
All right, lots of fighters. Your bombers should engage as many capital ships as possible. Okay, well it's be heartbreaking to watch the Reich the Reichmental I believe that's how that's pronounced. Father, fritter away our conventional forces. I've been successful in keeping his grubby hands off my new jet fighters. <laughs> Seeing as everyone's acting on their own initiative today, I thought I would take up a second squadron myself. Fearsome reputation. On any other day I would celebrate that, but... Today is not that day. What on earth is that? A panther pillbox. All right, well, it goes without saying. Wait, Galland is there, but don't I also have Galland? Do we have dual Gallons? I have Galland's identical twin brother. Yeah, <laughs> that's funny. Okay. <clears throat> um... Okay, so uh, it's pretty obvious there's no ground deployment slots anywhere. So I cannot... Um, I cannot... Um, deploy artillery. It's impossible. The game has prevented it, which is which is a shame because this mission would be well. Most missions have proven easy with artillery, but this mission would be super easy with artillery. Camouflaged anti-aircraft guns would devastate enemy fighter operations, and these ships are right next to the coastline where my. Uh, My artillery would tear them apart. Arkansas? Brooklyn? I'm just gonna try and get control of the coastline as soon as possible. Oh, right. Anyway, that is it for now. This, these, I need to think about my deployment. So, I will see you guys next time.